All right, what's going on, guys? So I'm here with a trading block. Uh, first up here will be what I have for the Sega Dreamcast. Uh, I have basically kind of a summarized list right here. You could take a look at that. That's going to be like a full bill. All the prices here are slightly lower, about 10 to 15 percent lower than what you would find on eBay. Um, I'm so you can see the prices there. What I've got here are two systems. I know for a fact one works. The other one, um, pretty much, I'm pretty sure it just needs um, lens adjusting. I'm sure you guys know exactly what that means, and some of you may even know what it, how to do it. Uh, but definitely, that one will need some lens cleaning, and the and the one that works, it works. But I'm sure in the next few years or so, it will probably need to adjust the lens on that one too. Other than that, they work fine. Not so well on really scratch games, but you know, that's just the lens talking there. Got four VMUs. Got three controllers there, one of the atomic color ones. Then we have D2. I've got uh, Grandia 2. Alone in the Dark. The New Nightmare. I've got one copy of Shenmue 2 that has all the booklets. And then one copy of Shenmue 2 that is only missing the Passport booklet. Uh, otherwise, all five of these games here are in excellent condition. Uh, there's I don't think there's any scratches on any of these at all. Um, they're just they're pretty much immaculate. Um, so, and like I said, everything's slightly lower than uh, where eBay's at. So I'm standing pretty firm on these prices, but that all depends on what you have to trade. And these prices obviously are if you are going to buy this stuff. Uh, but I am looking for kind of value, that value too in trades. But you guys know the value of these things. I, don't, I know the value of these things, so it shouldn't be a big problem. And like I said, um, I may, I'm going to be pretty firm on the prices just for the games. But you know, just come. At, but you know, don't. That doesn't mean uh, don't be afraid to offer what you have. Um, and that being said, I'm pretty much only looking for NES games, maybe some Super Nintendo games. There will be a list below um, with what NES games I need still and what I'm looking for. So that's that. Once again, there's the list if you want to buy it in full or just the individual prices. Uh, I may be a little, I'll be a little flexible on the two Shenmue's because uh, I think they are going for right around 20 or so, but there's plenty of them up there, so I might be a tad on those. Tad, tad flexible on those. Okay, um, next bid, I have a Battle Kid 2 Mountain of Torment sealed. I'm looking to get pretty much, I'm looking for about 50 to 60 for this. Pretty much just price of what you would pay on a retro USB and their shipping. Comes out to like 50 something. Uh, so I know Star Soldier 1, you were looking to copy this, so maybe you got something you want to trade for it. Uh, and I also have another, I also have a, um, a bubble wrap that this fits into. So that's up for trade. And then I have a uh, Sega Saturn here. It's got two controllers, all the cab the two cables, and it has uh, the racing wheel. Um, if anybody's interested in this, let me know. Um, I do have to just double check this one. So if you're interested, let me know and I'll plug this in and uh, just make sure it's working. Uh, I only have one game for it, some NHL game. You can have it if you want in the trade. If not, you know, it's just, it's not, I don't know, I don't know if it's worth anything or not. But I just one, I picked it up only so I could test out the system, to be honest. Okay, and last here, it's not really a game, but it is a Parrot drone. Now, I bought this, kind of got deceived on eBay. Um, they said it worked. It works. There's two big problems though. One, the battery is pretty much dead. It does not hold a battery life. So minus the cost of the battery. I think you can get them for about 20, 30 bucks maybe. 40 or 50 if you want a more powerful one. Um, and another problem it has, uh, there's, a, it has got some small connection problems where the battery plugs into. So if you actually have one of these or work with these, then you may understand how much, um, it's worth for parts um, so I you know working this would go for about 150 plus 
Um, so I'm looking for right around right around 100, um, and that's for the parts. You can strip this down. Everything else, all the other parts for this are in good shape. And um, if you are interested this in this, let me know, and I'll do just a breakdown of it for you um, privately. So, all right, guys, that's it. Um, there will be more stuff up soon, but for now, um, just take a look. If you need anything, let me know what uh, NES games you got. All right, guys, and like I said also before, um, just to clarify, I'm going to either trade or sell. If you're going to buy, I pretty much only accept PayPal unless I, you know, I know you in the community really well. I may accept cash if that's your only option. But other than that, um, if you're going to buy something from me, PayPal. Otherwise, I would prefer to trade for the NES games I need. So that's it, guys. All right. Stay tuned for more. Peace.